What's up you guys, Keith Tamela here. What I want to talk to you today about is the number one most overlooked factor when it comes to getting your first job in aviation, as well as this helps you as you rise through your career in aviation. The number one factor is who you know. And who you know can either be a good thing or a bad thing. You don't want to be the kind of guy where when someone thinks of you, and they have a negative association. They'll say, well, that person was a jerk to me or that person was not helpful when I needed the help. You'll be surprised how many people fall into that category. And it's their own detriment because when it came time for work, uh, they didn't even have allies or friends to vouch for them. I made the mistake to myself a couple of times. I'm not uh, free from this uh, error. But I quickly learned my mistake when I was in my early 20s and I realized, you know, in general, it's the golden rule. It's um, do unto others as you would have them do unto you. Uh, so it's a completely separate thing from having connections for your career. You just want to be a good person to the people in general. Within reason, obviously you don't want people to walk all over you, but you want to keep good connections with people as well as as the time moves on in your career, you want to check in with these people and uh, keep in touch. Uh, say, hey, how's it going? Uh, and uh, So that they will think of you versus when you're actually wanting a reference from someone and then you message them out of the blue maybe five years later, that person's going to think, hey, uh, this person didn't uh, bother to talk to me for the last five years, but now all of a sudden because they want a job, uh, they're actually messaging me right now. So I thought I'd pass this uh, quick message to you about being uh, nice to people and requesting them to, to give you a reference. Actually, half of my jobs in aviation have come from direct references from people who put in the word to the uh, hiring managers. And uh, the other half I got on my own, but it was a lot harder to get uh, when you are going for a job with uh, no one backing you versus when someone is backing you for the job. So uh, it's a quick lesson. I'm out here in Mexico. It's really warm. Enjoying the uh, little patio that they have on here. And I thought I'd make this quick uh, tip video. I feel like it's uh, not really talked about a lot. So hope this finds you well. And, uh,